For creation of advanced email campaigns, an entirely new section has been added to the build phase, and that's the automated workflow section. So what are automated workflows? Firstly, let's consider the idea of automation. Now imagine you were cutting down a tree. If all you had was an ax, it could take you several days and require several people to actually chop down a tree. And it would be very laborsome work. However, with modern technology, a single trained person with a train saw could do the same job in minutes. Automated workflows are simply a way for smaller teams or individuals to handle tasks that they couldn't do before in a marketing context. Workflows are made up of a trigger and an action. Take for example this sunrise clock. The sunrise clock can be set to activate at a certain time and trigger the light at the top of the alarm to help you wake up. Now the trigger is the timer on the clock and then the action is the light that switches on. And that's simply what a workflow is. It's a trigger and an action. There are two types of trigger. There's timer activated and then there's activity activated. So if we take for example these two lights, one is activated using a timer and the other is activated using a sensor. So the timer could be set at a particular time and day or repeating such as every weekday at 9 a.m. The sensor is activated by external activity such as motion or perhaps light levels. So if the light is getting brighter or the light is getting darker. Time-based or scheduled triggers are pretty consistent across marketing platforms. Generally you'll be able to trigger an action at a particular time and day and optionally you can put a repeating schedule usually on an hourly, daily, monthly and yearly basis. However, activity or behavioral triggers are very much dependent on which marketing platform you're working with. However, there are some common activities across most platforms. Those are monitoring and triggering of website activity, such as clicks, visits, filling in a form on a website, email activities, clicks, opens of emails, and data activity, when field values have changed or a lead becomes a member of a certain segment. Workflow actions are also dependent on the marketing platform you're working with. However, there are common actions across most. Channel actions are sending email, sending SMSs, and sometimes social activities. These are common. Data actions, such as changing Changing field values, changing segment membership are also quite common. Wait steps occur in most marketing automation platforms, so waiting a certain amount of minutes, hours, days. 